Of course, Mona. Come on. No. Uh -huh. You know how it gets sometimes. You know what I'm saying? If we just put water around, you know, it's crazy work. Oh, fuck it. But, uh, I'm guessing, I'm moon. guessing, just you know, the guy, you know what I'm saying? Like, I, I got told they need thermite charges for it. That's right. You do need thermite charges. And there's some other cool shit you can do with these thermite charges. Listen, buddy. You, before I tell you all this shit, you, you know anything that can help us out? Or pay these out? Anything? I mean, I'd assume you already know the shit I know, so. I mean, I heard, I, listen, I don't know how true it is, but I heard that, uh, you know, I've been to prison. I heard that, uh, you know, one of the lifers told me that the... DOC over there installed some new, I guess, uh, power boxes. You know what I'm saying? Very really? similar to the ones next to the uh, power station. Really? What the fuck is going on down there? Brother. Yeah, yeah, one of the lifers told me that, you know, there's a lot of new boxes in that prison. Hey, okay, John, I'm in the meeting. I get, unless this is important, I get it. Are you saying What's in up? the prison or like outside of it? Inside yeah, the yeah. prison. Oh, okay. Uh, one sec, I'll call you back here, girl. All right, bye. You guys hey, know about that or no? I, I, get, I get to go. Okay, uh, go. I didn't know. Sorry, go ahead one more time for it. No, I did not know about the power boxes. Brother, I'm hanging up. I'm sorry. I, I don't know what the fuck is going on. Um, yeah, I don't so, know about the fucking power boxes at the, the yeah, prison, so you, no. So yesterday I got arrested, right? You know, yeah, yeah. or some connections in prison or some lifers. They told yeah. me that they noticed some new uh, power boxes that the DOC installed, you know what I mean? He said there was like six of them or some shit. I don't know exactly, but uh, they look very right. similar to the ones that, the, you know, the ones we hit at the power plant? That's right, yeah. Yeah, they look very similar to that, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. now, I, don't know oh, if it's, way, I don't know if it's some new power for the prison or what it is, you know what I'm saying? But uh, who knows? Yeah. Did you guys end up going and doing that, by the way, the power plant shit? No, nah, no, nah, we didn't. Okay, uh, I'll be honest, brother. Don't do it uh, as of yet. It turns the power off in the city, but we've done it, and we we it we haven't found shit with it. So unless you guys have an idea as to what it is, uh, I gonna, do have an you, idea. You might, what do you think it is? I got told uh, might be to do something with the prison. That's what I'm. That's what that's what we're thinking. So you turn the power off in the city to break some people out of the prison? Doesn't maybe. say maybe it opens the gate, the security gate, maybe. Or some shit. That's what I'm. That's what that's what we're thinking. Yeah. Okay, I appreciate the information. All right, I'll get you some more. Uh, listen, uh, thermite, right? The thermite charge is going to have a lot of uses. Thermite charges can be used for these armored crates that we have uh, attained. You know, these armored red crates, the big ones. They probably have uh, tons of shit inside. They can also be used for the back of G6 trucks, including the local ones. Really? Yeah, we're not particularly sure what... Uh, you can attain yet by thermal charging them, but that's what we know because we haven't really got those yet. Another important thing is how you get these these red armored crates. You probably want to know, right? Right. <sighs> you know, forehead. I came from a very dangerous land way, way long ago. You know, called Russia. This fucking guy. <laughs> and in Russia, we had these uh, cargo ships, right? That uh, would go around the uh, the islands and the cities and shit like that, and they'd honk around and they'd honk at people. These armored ships were very fucking guarded, not just by normal people, but by military forces. You kind of mm. get what I'm saying? Mm, okay. Yeah, I see. I get what you're saying. Heard about the, I heard about some horn, dog. People were talking about some horns. Well, the whole morning was horning, you know. Anyway, we had fucking uh, we heard this horn and it, it felt like a natural instinct to me. Like I knew exactly what I had to do. I was born for this moment, you know. And I ran over to a boat and immediately got into it and swifted out to the sea. But I got into this boat and I swear, brother, it turned to a war zone. I was fighting fucking armored juggernaut guards with M4s and. And attack helicopters with miniguns on the side, and actual like, uh, uh, what are those ones called? The striker uh, attack helicopters, with miniguns on the front too. Attack helicopters? You fighting? God damn! Yeah. <laughs> yeah, these guys were fucking insane guards. By the way, they're like rolling around, locking doors on us, like shit like that. These guards were absolutely monstrous. We lost like uh, two or three people uh, before we cleared out the boat, and. Uh, when we cleared out the boat finally, and I walked up to one of these motherfuckers, right? These guys, hey, we pulled the guns on them, right? And mm -hmm. these are not some normal M4s we got. These oh. are 
These are 308 Black Point M4s. Mm. The double the caliber of a 556 five, assault rifle. I pulled that shit out and shot down the helicopter. Oh, so you, you were, we were really outside then, you know what I'm saying? You were, hey. Okay. That's right. So now, I, when I had the M4 in my hands, the Black Point rounds, I think I got like seven extended, maybe even more extended mags, 60 rounds each or some shit like that. But uh, we were able to fend off all the guards and uh, we took the scrap helicopter there, Habibi. And there's red cargo crates on top. We were able to move those wherever we want. Oh, you guys have the actual helicopter over there? Yeah, there's a helicopter on the cargo ship that you can take out. After we shot down all the attack helicopters attacking us and the boats and shit, I mean, here's the thing. A lot of groups want to counter us, right? Like, we had the Hydra and we had a lot of fucking other groups. But since we were on the boat already, it's very difficult for you to climb that ladder, you know? Mm. So these guys didn't really uh, didn't want to risk that. So we uh, just uh, secured the cargo crates. And that's why we had them this storm. And uh, like I said, the guards came back and took them back. There's probably trackers on them and shit. Okay. Yeah, my that's, one, that's, my, that's interesting, big dog. Okay. My one warning for you. If you go out to the sea and you go to this shit, I think four of us, maybe three of us had Glockatrons on us. Like armored, every single person armored up and we barely made it through. If I were you... I mean, yeah, no the, shit. If you fucking find attack helicopters. <laughs> yeah, like, I'm not surprised. We, we, I mean, yeah, we didn't have like the, the craziest uh, squad or anything, but like, you just gotta be, you gotta be fucking ready. These guys are not no joke. Mm -mm. Hey, listen, big dog, listen, I, I appreciate all the information you gave me, you know what I'm saying? I ain't gonna much yeah, to give I... you back right now, but, uh, look, if I get something and I find some shit out, I'll let you know, you know what I mean? I owe you one. I appreciate that. Hey, listen, I like this uh, this boarding ritual. I, I'll be honest, though, for today or to, tomorrow might be one of the last times I see you. So why is that? I'm I'm going back to a normal sleeping schedule. Oh. Yeah. Fair enough. Well, listen, if I find some shit out, I think Mona's running these times, right? Yeah, Mona's yeah, yeah, running. I'm you can, say, if I'm you always running. I'll let Mona know, you know what I mean? Yeah. Oh, you I'm guys, oh, you guys one. Yeah, I'm going to miss you, brother. It was nice to have this conversation in the morning. Yeah, nah, it's good. Yeah. Said you're like his morning coffee, you know? His morning can't get started without coming and chatting with you. <laughs> I never said that, but I do appreciate that sentiment. <laughs> okay. Alright, guys. Well, listen. Thank you for stopping by, you know what I mean? Like, Ray, mm. it was good seeing you. Hopefully, I'll see you around some more. If not, then I'll just let Mona know if we can find out. How are you guys doing, alright? Yeah, of course. Yeah, let me know, because I let Vidal know, like, shit as I, I find out as well, so, you know. Yeah. I'm assuming you already know about this oxy shit, right? For, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I, I gave Beam on one. Oh my god, you pushed me off! Ow! Oh, are you okay? Jesus. Do you have any on you? Yeah, I got like three of them, yeah. Okay, good. Hey, uh, actually, can I ask you a little bit more about that? Because I, I, my boys are all doing it and I have it. I have pink oxy on me, but what's you the want scuff one? that. No, I have, I have some okay, on me. Okay. What's the scuff that uh, people are referring to that I. Yeah. Wait, what do you mean? I only don't, I only don't want one. Oh, okay. What do you, what's the scuff you ran into? No, nothing. I just did it just fine. Okay. Damn, okay. No, it's no problems the... for me. I just did the run. I just all good. Only, I only did one run, so I haven't... You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't really know what's going on. Yeah, I heard that if you have all the boxes on you or some shit like that, it, it ruins it or some shit. Okay. Thank you, brother. Yeah. Nah. I'll let you know if hey, I find hey, Let me pop one oxy. As for it, he's gonna bunch. Wait, pop one? Yeah, man, here you go. 